And as Chief Williams retires soon, the search will begin for the next chief, a chief that will have to face some significant challenges in the department. Team 12's Colleen Sikora is live for us tonight, looking at some of the issues that her successor will take on. Colleen? Yeah, in recent weeks, police in Phoenix have been in the line of fire, shot, rammed, and otherwise attacked doing their jobs, all while the department faces staffing shortages, a federal investigation, and conflict in the community. All that? former PD staff say will mean a tough job for the next chief. Phoenix police officers attacked more than a dozen times in recent months. Henry, I'll be going upstairs to fill up my resignation letter then. And officers leaving the job. The next person to replace retiring Phoenix Police Chief Jerry Williams inheriting years of challenges. I think the next chief's going to have a hard job. During Williams' tenure, millions have been paid out in settlements by the city of Phoenix. Money, David Shammy, civil rights attorney, says could have been invested in the department instead. I would imagine that that $8 million could have been better spent on hiring um, better quality, um, better trained uh, police officers. Staffing issues forced the department earlier this year to move more than 100 officers from specialty units to patrol. We're over 400 officers down. Adding to the strain of officers already facing life-threatening situations, the Fraternal Order of Police in Phoenix writing in part, it is unacceptable not to hire officers when the city is flush with revenue and while we continue to lose experienced cops to neighboring cities offering bonuses and better pay. The Justice Department is opening an investigation into the city of Phoenix and the Phoenix Police Department. While the DOJ investigates use of force, retaliatory activity against protesters, and officers' treatment of the homeless population, among other issues. Former Phoenix Police Commander Mike Parra says it's trust the next chief will need to build within the department and the community. It's a great department. It just needs more leadership and guidance to be able to get them through the tough times. And that's what they need. They need to build that trust Now, Phoenix's city manager Jeff Barton is planning to hire an interim chief from outside the office to help the department get through the DOJ's still open investigation. Live in the Alert Center, Colleen Sikora, 12 News.